it guys. I got a unit that's not starting. Power was off. So uh, I went along and took out my uh, my compressor wires. So when I test my compressor wires from ground with just my meter, I got continuity there. If I go from ground to the actual ground, I don't got anything there. All right, I go to ground here. I got nothing there. I go from ground there. I have nothing there. But when I take my Subco M500, it shows. I'll show you guys right now. All right. Shows that it's bad. So, common winding is bad. Start winding is bad. And we'll check out the run winding. Shows is bad. So, let's pop it open. We're gonna check out the system. Harness looks fine. Wires don't look rubbed out. All right, so I'm gonna make a lead for my ground. Normally I'll rub this I'll rub this out right here. One lead. We're good there. We're good there. And we're good there. Let's check. Check our windings. We got 1.5, 1 1.4, we got 1 ohm, and it totals out to 2.5, 2.6, that's about right. All right. So, Let's put this plug back in. Let's see if it'll start right up. On my field piece, it doesn't show that the system is compressor is grounded. But when I test from a mega ohm meter, it tests that the windings test that the windings are not that are not that good are not good. So the windings are deteriorating in the system inside the compressor and the uh, compressor may not last long so we'll see if it starts right up we got a new capacitor there it was replaced before this is a pretty simple system, straight, cool. There's nothing special about it. All right. Start it right up. All right, guys, so basically on this test from the mega ohm meter, just proves right now that the compressor compressor is failing 
as far as the winding. The windings are deteriorating. There's not a real good lifespan on this unit. So let's check pressures. So these are my quick gauge check. I carry all that in my one bag. So we got an R22 system. So that's 75 PSI. All right, R22, we got that there. About two, looks about 200. All right. Or 175 rising up so pressures look pressures look decent to me okay we still got to check superheat and subcool but I'll check you guys out later thanks